driving in the sun this time of year. Yeah, there's a couple of longliners right there. We've been plugging away, keeping the cannery busy. Season's over, it was pretty fast for him this year. Well, it wasn't that big, but it's going quick. So now, I think we'll be able to get out and get some fishing with you guys. Yeah. We got some trawlers working. Well, hot guy there. Which fishery did they just wrap up? Were they doing Pollock? Uh, Pollock started on the 20th of January, but I think they, they were standing down to wait until the row was better. Okay. So they I can see. take advantage of that um, good market. It's all clear. We're both there. That's how we like it. Just our van. Yeah. It didn't last very long, but I mean they really just got fuel gauge, pretty nice setup. Get the shut off valve, we go pretty slow, filling up the fish tail so it doesn't bubble up and gush out of the vent. How much are we getting today? Oh, I'll probably just put like one can over here. Sounds good. That should be good for a while. Just get a little weight on the bottom. Yep. This side over here is our our main 
engine side and uh, the starboard we pull off for the generator and the stove. Yeah, we really just run the main off this one side just because this thing burns so little fuel. Fuel management's really easy on here. Wanna we'll check it? Yeah. Titan, otherwise we'll just mash your O-ring to oblivion. And how'd we do? What's the damage? Better twenty-five. Not bad, eh, Dad? Yeah, that should get us there and back again. Yeah, a few times. Yep. So. All right, well, Guess back to our it. stall. Yeah. And we're all ready to go. Get up bright and early in the morning and run out to our fishing spot. So we'll see you guys in the morning. Welcome back, guys. Hey, everyone. So we're just uh, heading out here. A little spot we can cut through here it saves us some time pretty jagged rocks over here it's really beautiful a lot of birds nest on this in the spring puffins and seagulls one of the rocks out here on the end has a nice arch through it probably be able to see it here in a little bit so yeah Bunkers up there somewhere. So I didn't download my marks off the other computer. Well, they were on this one, but um, it's an old format and not recognizing it. So we're just kind of starting with a blank slate here. <laughs> so we'll just see what happens. Yeah. Try and remember where we used to fish, but I'm gonna drive around and start collecting some new marks. I do like this program though, it's layers. Yeah. It's very nice. It's very helpful. Keep this just straight. Beautiful out here, no wind. Just a little swell. Just get some fish. So we're going after rockfish today. Um, we got some fresh markets that we need to fill. Our small fish will go to those and our large ones will get filleted up and they'll be getting shipped out here. 
quarters, you'll have some fish coming from the floor wall. We're still a little limited by our processor right now. Um, the long line season for cod just finished up and they just got absolutely swamped by the long line fleet. So uh, they weren't able to do any of our fish yet. But they should be getting everything cleaned up here towards the end of next week, I guess. Yep. So we can go out and get some bigger loads. And nice to get to work. Yeah. That's where we're at on that. So we're just going to cruise out here a little ways and start the hunt. Alright, so I guess we'll uh, keep traveling here. I'll go prep up the deck. There's not really a whole lot to do. I'll string out the jigs and clip on the breakers for the, for the jiggers. Go activate the other deck hand. Yep. <laughs> Okay guys, so uh, just got our first little haul back here, first bites of the day, first little batch of fish, just looking around, trying to find our bearings. <laughs> yeah, we perfect fish, you. they're nice fish. Yeah, perfect size for our market, so. we'll take them. Just a quick little bite here. I guess we'll just yeah. keep jigging around, looking for uh, for more hits. Yeah, just trying to get the cup sorted here. I don't remember what we're doing. To get this new crew whipped into shape. That's right. Getting his sea legs. I never lost my sea leg. <laughs> Yep, got some, some ice on the deck just from uh, snow the other day, slushed out, so chip it off, throw the hose on it. It's pretty warm out, huh? It is warm it's out. It's nice without wind. Yeah. <laughs> Feels good. I mean, considering it's February. On. That would be a good idea. Spot number two. How's it looking? Just patchy. They're down on bottom. Hard on bottom. Might be losing some gear today. Well, hopefully not. Oh, nice. The tangle. First hook in the hand for the year. 
Love it. Love it. Four pack. You see, Matt, Dad expertly works around that tangle. Did he yeah. even slow him down at all? He navigated it perfectly, <laughs> like a true captain should, showing the crew how it's done. You can tell he's a master. He's that obstacle before. All right, guys. So, little start here. Got a 28-ish for the fresh market bin and about nine for the play bin. Got our deck organized. Tristan's help here. Chipping away at this ice. Yep. So what we're doing here is uh, we bleed into these bleed out bins and then we put them into this next bin after they're done bleeding out. Kind of keeps the, the heavy uh, blood off of them and just kind of cleaner later when we gotta actually gut them. Little ices, just keep them nice and cold. That's where we're at right now, just kind of on the hunt, looking for some more fish. Oh, are you gonna make me the star of this video? Yep, limelight. You're gonna put me on the thumbnail right here. Yeah, I should. Strike a pose. Uh, how? Do something funny. <laughs> Good. Like Tristan here has a bite. I eat it. Looks like one. you got some fish on there, Pete. Some pull on that one. Be careful, Pete. Don't let them rockfish fall on your feet. Nope. Yeah, please. Move motion. Got a lipper. Lift them up and over. There you go. Nice. That's it. Got fish on too. Whoa. You can see how much they jiggle. That's them pulling on my hand. They've got some force behind them. What do I do now? Just de hook them by hand. Ling cod. There you go. There's the ling cod, guys. Falling. The lingus. Yep. Season's closed. Or else they need too small anyways. Yep, 32 inches, same as halibut. So, back in he goes. Let me on. Yep. I got a few on mine. Black rockfish. Oh, looks like you got a bite already. Oh, I did? Yeah, look at that. Whoa. Vigorous bite, too. I'm a pro at this. Ooh. And don't worry, if you drop the camera in the water, by theory, it should float. Really? By theory. Yeah, that, that handle floats. Well, it's kind of a good thing. Yeah. <laughs> kind of a good thing. <laughs> when, should I, good when should I pull mine up, then? Uh, after I get mine started going down again. Wow, that's a nice pull down. Wow. There we go. Got a couple of uh, flares in that one. I think you stole some of mine. Did I? I believe you did. That potentially may be the case. <laughs> we got a little uh, catch net here to fish out any floaters that think they're gonna get away. So sometimes I'll unhook by hand for just one or two, but you get a full stringer. Get your gas. Yeah, 
twist them. Extra, extra speedy. Okay. Our ears back up. Oh, yellowtail. Yep, bottom fishing is tough. Uh, gotta watch your uh, your setups close. Hang up on that craggy rock down there. Pretty easy to lose them. Wow, they are munching, Dad. They're munching. Yeah, up and out. <laughs> Here it comes. There we go. Got some on there. One tea. Oh, even more down low. Whoa. Bonus. Another one. Four more down there, T. Very nice. What can I say? I'm a natural born pro. <laughs> True. Dad got a nice stringer up there, too. There you go. I'll give you a hand. Off with a gaff, just stick your gaff in the in the circle of the hook and just keep them twist like that. Watch yourself. Through the swivel, however that's possible. Got it? I do not wish to get that taken for a ride. Yes. Would not be pleasant. Go ahead and set her back down. There we go. Go down there. Yep. Dad? That might be it, but good little hit. Maybe we'll drift over some more here. We shall see. Good start anyways. Are we wanting to just fill a coat with uh, a couple of coats maybe? A player? I think so. Two would be 150 pounds fish. Yep. So two. Or I can try to just like split out these larger ones like this. Yeah, I think we'll get some larger ones. I got one nice one here, so. Just figure out how to sort these to start. Yeah, I just put like the big ones like that in there. Okay. And then we can get a couple of those orders out. Okay. Which would be good. Very good. All right, well, um, yeah. That was okay. Bring them up, I suppose.
So this is a yellowtail, just a cousin to the rockfish we catch, I guess. <laughs> they all seem pretty related. They all look the same, so. Those ones are really good. Yeah, we'll eat him for dinner. They've got a really good flavor. Kind of reminds me more of like a yellow eye. Yes. I agree. Once one gets on, they seem to light up a little bit more. Gets their friends into a feeding frenzy. Yeah. Fear missing out. Yep. FOMO. like a couple players on there. Yep. Yeah. Nice. It's like Tiga player too. Is that it? Yep. Yeah, good ratio. Those hooks back out. Yep. Yep. They can bite you. They love fingers just as much as I love black rockfish. <laughs> you have to teach Especially you the nice twist off technique, eh? Sharp ones. <laughs> they really dig into the flesh. Here you go, just set them down the rail. Watch your foot. Grab his lip there. that down. Here we go. Oh, I caught you. Ah, I caught you. Fired up. Little green wing. Oh, nice. Here you go. I'm afraid that happened. Oh. This is a green lean. These are beautiful little fish. Here, I'll get them in the sun. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> they got cool fins, cool speckles. 
They're pretty. Get out of here, you. Not too bad, Deb. Uh, well, not. Oh no! Oh no! Get your get your web, your net, get your net off the table. Hurry! Make haste, but not too hasty. In. Got it? Yep. And that's why we have a net and not a gap or a little J hook to catch those. Some people just get hook sticks with a little hook, barb hook on it and try and gaff their fish. But yeah. Yep. Hey guys, just taking a little lunch break here. Wholesome meal of uh, peanut butter and jellies and some snack mix over there. <laughs> Quick and easy. That's our motto. That's right. Healthy, full of protein. Mm-hmm. So pretty decent start to our day, huh, Dad? Yeah, so there was like 130 fish on that drift. Mm-hmm. Two drifts, same one. We did the did that same drift two times, more or less. Nice. You never really go over it exactly. So, um, yeah. The second one was better. Fish were a little bigger, huh? There's some bigger fish on that side. Yeah, there were some good flares. So yeah, that was good. So just having a little bit of a, a lunch break here and we'll get back to it. <laughs> 